Hi friends, today we are going to discuss about turbojet engine working principle. So here the contents are introduction, main components and functions and working principle of turbojet engine. So first of all introduction turbojet engine. So every action there is an equal and opposite reaction. This is the Newton's third law. So here one of the most widely used air breathing engine in aircraft propulsion is turbojet engine. Having a turbine driven compressor and a developing thrust from the exhaust of hot gases is a turbojet engine. Main components and functions of turbojet engine diffuser. So, this is the one of the basic and main components of the turbojet engine. It converts kinetic energy into pressure energy of air from the atmosphere. Compressor here, the compressor rotary compressor are used. The air is to be compressed for high pressure. Compression chamber. The air and the fuel mixed hence the compression will tax price inside the compression chamber. Turbine to expand the air from high temperature and low pressure to the temperature low and pressure. So last one, the nozzle was used in turbojet engine. It converts the pressure energy to kinetic energy and releases with high velocity of burner gases from the exit. So next we have to discuss about working principle of turbojet engine assuming the inert air at 0 0.6 bar and minus 20 degrees celsius normally the atmospheric air is 1 bar so here at uh, high altitude the pressure is considered as 0 0.6 bar and minus 20 degrees celsius here the atmospheric air 0 0.6 bar of air is enters into the diffuser so the diffuser is usually to increase the pressure of atmospheric air so normally the 0 0.6 bar pressure is approximately increased to 1.5 bar so then the pressure of the gas enters into the compressor here the compressor was used because to compress to the air at a high pressure then the high pressure of the gas is passed to the combustion chamber here the combustion will take place here the air and the fuel mixed together and the combustion will take place inside the combustion chamber then the combusted gas will be expanded through the turbine this turbine was used to compress to drive the compressor and other accessories of the turbojet engine then okay, the fuel is mixed with the high pressure and yeah, then the combustion takes place inside the combustion chamber after combustion the gases is to be expanded through the turbine which is also used to drive a compressor and other accessories of turbojet engine then the expander gases is to be released through the nozzle with a high velocity so thank you for watching this video